my wife drove uh, to, uh, to Seattle, and uh, I tapped out the first draft of the business plan in the car on the way there. I also called our attorney. I, I called a friend in Seattle and said, can you recommend an attorney? Um, uh, re retain an attorney by cell phone and had that person set up bank accounts and uh, so on so that those were all ready by the time we got there. Uh, had him incorporate the company. And of course, he's got me on the cell phone. I said, what should the name of the company be that you need for the incorporation? And I it was very clever. I had already thought of this. I knew he was going to ask me that question. And so without even missing a beat, I said, Cadabra, Cadabra Inc., like Abracadabra. Well, I instantly knew that was an incredibly dumb name because he came back to me right away with Cadaver? <laughs> I said, no, 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 not Cadaver, Cadabra. And he was like, Cadaver? I said, no, no. <laughs> so anyway, the company was incorporated as Cadabra Inc. Uh, right there. And three months later, was changed to Amazon.com. Uh, a name that uh, actually the entire A section of the dictionary was perused. Turns out that things are always listed online in the order, uh, in almost always in alphabetical order. So kind of like the yellow pages where you get the triple A auto repair phenomenon. You start to see that. In fact, we do have a competitor, a small competitor online called like triple A one books or something like that. Um, so uh, uh, it, and it was, that's also, it was hard to pick a name. Because even then, in 1994, uh, most of the good domain names were gone already. Um, so Amazon.com was people considered to be early, but actually it was not that early uh, in this race. The Mosaic Communications, which would later become Netscape, had already been started several months before. Wired Magazine had already started Hot Wired. Uh, Halsey Minor had already started CNET. These things were happening very, very quickly.